Hey everybody, Faust here, and today we're going to be playing some Amnesia. I have no idea what I'm going to be getting into. I do know that this game came out years and years ago, but I completely forgot to play it. So we're going to get into it just before the brand new one gets out. We're going to see if we can get past through The Dark Descent and A Machine for Pigs before Rebirth comes out. And without further ado, we're going to start. We're going to play it normal, because I can't handle hard mode at all I am I am I am basic as heck I like my pumpkin spice I like pumpkin spice protein and lattes and frappuccinos Don't forget, normal mode be forgotten. And I have no idea what's going on can I, can I, hello I can I leave now my name is Daniel I live in London damn Daniel coming in uh, coming at us again with them big ass stairs. I thought we were on stairs. Are the stairs behind us? There's not. There's blood. My name is. Is. I am Daniel. Daniel. Damn, Daniel. Everything is dark, Daniel. So I guess we are going to be Daniel. I have no I I I don't I don't I don't uh, This is not where I parked my car, sir. We have blood and pink. I'm pretty sure we do not bleed pink, so I'm gonna guess the blood is probably ours. Aha! Okay. Momentum has been a uh, memento has been added. Quick access Press M. I don't have an M. Follow the liquid trail and find its source. Okay. Can I go in here? Aha! I figured out how to open doors. What's this? Nope. 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 I have picked up tinderbox okay I have to remember that I don't press a, a is to jump and that is that is to not go that way okay Whew. can I no no I don't want to I don't want to take that I don't want to light things on fire thank you very much okay I can't go this way. oh this liquid trap well is this am I falling That was weird. What am... Alright, if this guy's gonna get scared... Uh -huh. <gasps> Look what I found. Hold down the left mouse and slash RB and move the mouse slash thumb th stick in, open to, in order to open or remove the door. Press right mouse or LB to throw the door open or shut depending on the direction you face. Uh -huh. Does that mean I can... Does that mean I can throw this? Oh, I can! Haha! <laughs> can I sit? <gasps> We're gonna take this chair with us. Get out of here, you rapscallion! Eat chair! Huh! <laughs> Haha! <laughs> Anything in there? Nope. Anything in here? Yes, there is. Thank you. I have I are these the stairs that I was walking down before? Actually they may be. Okay. Maybe this liquid is ours then. I kinda hear something behind me. You know, the amount of creaking makes me think that I'm on a ship. But the brickwork makes me That was the weirdest thing. It was like I just sunk into the floor. Am I supposed to be sinking? All right. What's this? Can I? No, I can't take a look behind there. Nothing in there. What's down here? Hello? Excuse me. 
Hey, look, another tinderbox, right? Aha! It's not even a tinderbox. That's like a tinder s circle. No. Sphere? No. Cylinder. Hello, is there anything in here? Ugh. Beware, sunny in darkness, your sanity will slowly drain down the lights and the environment. Okay. What if I just get out of the place that's dark? What, what about that? That seems like a smart idea. Can I run? I can. Left trigger. So this game is kind of scary. However, what I think I should do is just make fun of the entire thing. So like, I don't know how, don't ask me, I'm gonna pick up this book. Fuck you. You can't. Ha! When unsettling events, witnessing unsettling events will reduce your sanity and increase by completing puzzles and making progress, okay. Okay, but, like, what if there's not a puzzle in here? Hello, is there... Whoops. I'm gonna get... I'm gonna get nabbed by something because I can't pick shit up. What the fuck? Are those, like, cockroaches? I hope this game does not, like... Have a thing where if you get too scared... I pick this stuff up. I want to read the letter. Come on. You know what we say to unsettling events? Shut you. How is this game like a billion years old? And. Ooh, that's scary. Look at that wind from a window. Scary stuff. Come on! Ooh, give this to me. <gasps> yeah. Alright. You can't. Oh. Uh. Haha! -ha. Supposed to go this way. Ah! See? I know where I'm going. Can I light these on fire? Oh, I can! Oh. And if it's bright in here, I should probably, like... Oh my god. How is this... How is this place still standing? Like... It's getting all sorts of... Wonky. There we go. Can I go this way? Oh, I can't. I just hit myself. No, I don't want to go... I don't want to... No! You can't make me go over there. How about eat that? No, I said eat this. <laughs> no, fucking give me another one. Well, that's unrealistic. All right, I'll take that and I'll read this. August, 1839. Okay. I wish I could ask how much you Fuck. remember. I don't know if there'll be anything left after I consume this drink. Don't be afraid. Friend. That's how I feel I when I drink. Why, but know this: I choose to forget. Why? That's usually why we drink, Daniel. There is a purpose. You are my final effort to put things right. God willing, the name Alexander of Brandenburg still invokes bitter anger in you. If not, this will sound horrible. Horrible. the inner sanctum. Find Alexander and kill him. Yep, this is a regular drinking night for me. Find the old dude named Alex. Murder. He will be no match for you. One last thing. A shadow is following you. It's a living nightmare. So regrets. Breaking down reality. I have tried everything and there is no way to fight back. You need to escape it as long as you can. Redeem us both, Daniel. No. Send into the darkness where Alexander waits and murder him. Your God, this guy is just a badass Daniel. murder. All right, let's go murder. Is there 
anything over here? <gasps> what, what happens if I pull this? <gasps> Is this where I'm supposed to go? Look at look at this. The fuck are those things? Those cockroaches? Gross. Traveling to Dover meant going through Canterbury. He made sure to pay a visit to avoid the sense of guilt connected with neglect of family. He's better than I am. Hold down this to run. You just like Alexander, floating. Is it inside the castle? In a manner of speaking. Come, bring the lamp. No. You've been to the refinery, have you not? I don't believe I have. Is it connected to the What does this one look like I'm able to pick up? The inner sanctum. My most precious chamber, Daniel. And it lies well beyond the refinery. In fact, it lies beneath the very stone of Brennenburg. Isn't that where Yennefer was from? Brennenburg? From, like, The Witcher? I don't know. I feel like that's where she was from. What's this? I need a key. Okay. I need to go find myself a key. Well, let's go down the way that it told me to. Down this way. Keep fucking hitting myself in the face. What the shit is this? Can't be tough. Okay, momento. Find a key to the wine cellar. Uh, sort of organic tissue blocks the path. Can it be dissolved? All right. My uh, my senses are telling me that I have no idea. Okay, let's go to the lab because apparently I can go to the lab. I don't know. Um, okay, a fragrant taste of rose lingered in his mouth. Turkish delights, he thought, just like the ones at the consulate in Constantin Constantinople. Not Istanbul, but Constantinople, because it's been a... Well, I can't go that way. What the hell is that, like, yelling? What does this say? Whoops. Alright. The lack of chimney to proper vent the fumes from my most recent experiments has taken a toll on many of my less stable ingredients to start. It seems... Some seem unaffected, but many are stained by the fumes that will be too difficult to salvage. I shall do what I can to move them to the wine cellar. Alright. Let's see. We found some shit over here. Early alchemy experiment. This is my third attempt to produce artificial vitae. Vitae? The former compounds lack the potency I need, but I sense I am close. Calamine and orpiment are given, are given, and the cuprit binds them well. This time I'll attempt aqua regia instead of aqua fortis in hope to produce a more even solution. The experiment was unsuccessful. The solution was highly acid, is highly acid, and provides impractical to put to any use except for as a detergent. Organic tissue reacts especially violently to the solution and should be handled with the greatest of care. I might be able to use the recipe, but I'm losing hope I will find an alchemic solution to my predicament. Said, fuck out of here. Oh, look at that. What do I find? One day I will return. If it wasn't for the thought of you, my love, I wouldn't be able to go on. 
When I find myself doing terrible things, I take comfort in you. As long as I'm able to think of you and long for a life together, I know I am better than the others. I weep for them. They lust for power without restraint, where I only crave fair judgment and a safe return. Alright, well, that doesn't help. All you are is just like, well, well, I want to see my lady. Okay. Is there said somewhere in the... Oh, yeah, we're going to pick some oil. Yeah. I said we're going to grab this. Fuck you. And... <laughs> What's that? Ooh, is this a chest? Oh, I was hoping for like a key or something. Some sort of like Zelda montage. Good luck trying to get past these. Find a key though. Maybe a key is this way? I don't know. Then the children cheered him on, his name voiced in a steady rising pace, urging him to do it. Am I really doing this? The young boy thought and struck his victim with a rock. Jesus. Wow! Holy crap! I'm coming. Hello? I don't know who said that. I think he came from up here, though. Maybe it's in the archives. I fell to the kitchen floor. Tears were beginning to well in his eyes as he received the first kick in his stomach. Hazel remained hidden in fear she, too, would be punished. Who kicks somebody in the stomach? It doesn't seem too dark, so I don't think I need to use... Oh, what's this? I hereby offer my full attention and services to Alexander, Baron of Brenneberg. This contract will reign for a total of three years when my freedom shall return to me. In addition, Alexander, Baron of Brenneberg, is to recommend my services at the Prussian Royal Court and within the sanctum of the Order of the Black Eagle. May no man break the seal. Willem, House of Grinch. Interesting. I say, fuck your chair. Hashtag, fuck your chair. Nothing. Nothing. And let me guess. Mm, oops. Nothing. Oh, <gasps> something. Yes. Anything in here? Nope. Nothing I can steal from there. Okay, well, where does this go? Where? Can I steal this? Oh, I can just light that on fire. Okay, but I want to go in here. Look, there's more of them. 16th of May, oh. 1839. The unflinching African sun has continued to plague our expedition, making it impossible to dig until dusk. How Professor Herbert managed to find the location in these vast plains of nothingness remains a mystery to me. When I asked him about the tomb again, he told me about the legend of Tin Hanan, the mother of us all. An interesting story in its own right, but I can't help feeling there's more. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dune leading to a sand-covered stone structure. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought and ordered the others to clear the way late into the dark, cold night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. This son of a bitch, I'ma steal his finds. Alright, what is in here? Fucking, there better not be more of these, like, what are they, what, what are they, cockroaches? 
let's go. Left or right? You know what? We're gonna go through this door first. Study. I just heard somebody being like, William, I don't want shirts. Shirts do me no good. What am I supposed to do? Wear them? Oh, you know what we do with chairs? Fuck the chair. Oh. Oh, what does this say? 17th of May. Ooh, we got another. My hands tremble on my right. I feel a need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me. Good. Dunga. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure it's we probably third. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. I mean, you obviously weren't, because you can write this. All right, uh, we're going to take a break here. We're going to just be done with the first part of Amnesia. Thank you very much for joining me. I will see you all in part two. If you like this and uh, uh, want to see more of it, please let me know in the comments below. Like, subscribe, ring that notification bell, and we will see you later. Bye-bye.